Here's Coach Mike Aikens. Coach, obviously a big game getting ready for you guys here tomorrow, the Robertson Cup Championship. Just walk us kind of through these last few days. Obviously a big win against St. Cloud, but just fill us into today. Yeah, we were, you know, we were proud of the guys. We, we battled. We just, we found a way to win. We obviously got great goaltending. But, you know, we scored some really nice goals and, and uh, big time goals at key points of the game. So really, really proud. You know, that that's a heck of a hockey team that, that we beat and well coached and uh, we we certainly feel fortunate to you know be able to get get past them and and now here we are to have an opportunity to win a championship uh, in our inaugural season is pretty special. So yesterday we had the day off. We went down, had a great meal at uh, Brazilian Steakhouse downtown, and uh, want to thank our ownership group. We spent a lot of money yesterday, so it was great. Uh, certainly appreciated by the guys and well deserved by the guys. Speaking of that, of these last few days off, how huge is that for you guys? But something also not to look over as uh, obviously New Jersey is kind of buzzing here, ready for this next game tomorrow. Yeah, we came and watched the game last night, and um, what an exciting game. Uh, you know, secretly you're, you're hoping they're going to go eight overtimes and just keep beating each other up and, and tire themselves out. But, you know, it was a great game to watch. Both teams were were awesome. Uh, you could see little adjustments the coaching staffs were making and and the, the passion that both teams were playing with was really, really exciting. And, you know, we knew either way we were going to have to play a good hockey team. So uh, you got to give New Jersey credit for battling back and finding a way to win and, and scoring a big power play goal at the end. So we know we're going to have our hands full just just like we have in every series we've had this this year. And, and now you're down to one game. you got to win one more. And, um, you know, we'll, we'll do our best to lay down the line and try and make that happen. Super Bowl of junior hockey is tomorrow. One game decides it all. Talk about the feel in the locker room right now, the feel at the hotel, your coaching staff, and kind of your, your just mentality going further. Yeah, we're trying to just kind of do things the way we always do it. And we're just laughing in the locker room. But this team, our team, uh, struggles with breakaways. And we, we do it every, every Thursday before a game. We play Orange Lemon. And I said, we'll have to schedule 48 minutes of that for us to be able to get everybody to score a goal. Uh, you know, we're just going to keep on doing what we do I'm really you know our guys are happy coming to the rink still at this time of the year which is a huge part of the battle uh, you look outside and you know they'd like to be golfing they'd like to be home we've been going since August 16th is when we started so uh, it's been a long year for us and I, I really give our guys credit for for sticking in it and they they love each other they want to be here and uh, you know it's it's we're having fun what do you see in New Jersey's game and what uh What's your process going forward and how you're going to take on them tomorrow? Yeah, I think, you know, they're, they're very skilled. They're dangerous up front. Uh, the evidence last night, some of those backdoor plays they made, the, the empty net goal that they scored to tie the game was an unbelievable, you know, look to the back door and great one-time goal. Uh, I, I like their power play. We're going to have to stay out of the penalty box. And, and you just have to admire their, their compete and tenacity. And they're a little bit like we are. So you have two teams that kind of just know no other way to play, I think, from what I see. Kind of talk about how you guys are going to try to not play into that type of game that they bring. Yeah, we, you know, we try to play a disciplined game. And, I, I, you know, I thought both teams were, you know, going to the net and trying to draw the other teams into making penalties and stuff. So, uh, you know, we... I think our guys will be smart. We're, we're, we do play hard. I, I just I don't I think we know where the line is, um, and we try not to cross that line. And and we want to stay out of the penalty box and take advantage of of opportunities that uh, maybe the other teams don't stay out of it. So, you know I I don't think that's going to be an issue for us. We're going to go to the net. We're going to play the way that we play. And and um, you know if we have to stand up for each other, we can we can do that too.